Joint Service Outdoors. God bless America. What's up, everybody? Uh, Rick here, Joint Service Outdoors. Today, we are heading to the archery range to go shoot the bow some, make sure we got it all zeroed in, ready to go for deer season. Got about three more weeks, four more weeks before deer season starts. So, pretty excited about that. As you saw in the last couple of videos, we have uh, we've done some scouting. Uh, went and put some trail cameras out. We uh, got a new stand set up. I showed you that in the last video. Uh, so excited about that. So now, last thing we got to do is get the bow tuned in and get to shooting again and get everything all ready to go. <clears throat> it's been about months since I shot the bow um, but I got some new arrows switched over to uh, I was shooting the eastern flat lines before uh, decided to go a little bit heavier this year um, total arrow weight and uh, switched over to the eastern 6.5 bit heavier the flat lines I believe are like 7.2 grains per inch and these eastern 6.5 are like right at 9 grains per inch um, so it's gonna be a little bit different sighted in but shouldn't be too far off shouldn't take me much uh, I shoot a single pin HHA so I'll have to change the tape on it I'm sure but um, yeah, heading out to Otter Creek. Uh, it's a place here local to Fort Knox. They got an outdoor range. It goes from zero to 60, I believe. And they got a little uh, walkthrough 3D course that you can shoot. So uh, we're just gonna try to get a little bit of everything today. But uh, yeah, appreciate you guys coming along and uh, stick with us. For the archery range? Huh? The archery range? Okay. How many? Just one. Appreciate it, man. Have a good one. Yeah. All right, just got a uh, paid for range at Otter Creek. Like I said they got a bunch of targets out there, and it's ten dollars for day use, but it's cool beats having to shoot 20 yards in a yard but uh yeah y'all stick with us
I'd say he smoked. If we was hunting elk, he'd be in a truck. Alright, well, thanks for coming along. I was able to at least get my marks knocked out. It's getting pretty warm out here, but um, not specifically concerned about, you know, hitting a dot out there at 60 yards. I just kind of wanted to get my marks so I know which tape I got to use uh, for anybody who's ever used a single pin know what I'm talking about and for those that don't so when you use a single pin there's a specific tape that fits the distances based on your arrow weight and bow speed so um, with me changing these arrows um, I was just trying to get my mark so I can uh, know which tape to use and oddly enough the tape that's on there right now um, is almost perfect I believe it might be the exact tape difference is what was my 20 30 40 50 60 yard mark before for me to hit 20 it had to be on 25 for me to hit 30 it had to be on 35 so forth so on so uh, I think it's the, the same tape <clears throat> I'll go home and slide it up a little bit and uh, come back at a later date and get the left and right and groups and all that stuff dialed in maybe on a day it's a little cooler But yeah, all in all, it was fun. Went out and tested them on a couple of 3D targets just to make sure that I was at least in the kill zone. Um, or the fatal V, what they call it. Vital V. Vital V. So, yep, it's been a fun day. Appreciate you guys tagging along. Um, and as always, thanks for your support. Appreciate each and every single view every share every subscribe um, it means the world to us if you're not subscribed yet hit that little little round joint service outdoors logo over there go ahead on subscribe and you can click the bell to get notifications when we upload some more videos so uh, thanks for all you guys do please head over and follow us on Facebook Instagram uh, we have a website www jointserviceoutdoors.com uh, we're in the process of building a store right now that's almost complete we do have merchandise for sale if you head over to our Facebook page you can see pictures and stuff of it all and uh, yeah hit us up let us know what you like for now until the store is built if you want something just send me a message and I'll take care of it but uh, thanks you guys for tuning in and we'll see you next time